Why have you chosen me to become your disciple? <laughs> I cannot understand. Why me, Jesus? Why me? Francisco? Shh, quiet. Don't run away. Come and see us here. What are you doing here and... Oh my God! Did you drink the last wine? No, I did not. Oh, brother. Then, why is stuff empty? I brought it here full this afternoon. Shh, stop it. Don't worry uh, about this. No, brother. Father Ronald will be angry with you if he will be caught. No, he will not be angry with me if you will not tell him. Ah, uh, no, Francisco. Uh, this is not good. You're stealing. Anyways, I am entrusted to take care of this sacristy, so I am free to do and get whatever I want here. Francisco? Benedict? What are you doing here? Uh, <laughs> in memory, my lights were up. No? Why? Is this a place for a heresy? No, but... But I think this is the best place to memorize the past, isn't it, Benedict? Ah, uh, yeah, Benedict. You see, this is a sacristy, and you're supposed to give reverence to the place and to the sacred things here. Wait, wait. These are Father uh, Alejandro's vestments. Oh, and why is the wine intended for tomorrow's mass half consumed? Can anybody please explain this to me? Benedict? Do you have anything to say? Uh, Benedict, answer me! Uh, Fra Francisco drank the wine, Father! Oh, Francisco! Look what you've done! Father, I'm so sorry! But I am just disappointed! that I wasn't able to be on top of the class. I am a smart student in our school, yet I was outshrunk by my nerd class by a single point only. What? Francisco, stop it. Is that word justifying? Because of losing the honor to be the class valedictorian, you did all these unnecessary acts? Oh, Francisco. Because of what you've done, you will be banned to enter the sacristy until I lift up that sanction. And Tomorrow morning, you go first to confession before receiving Holy Communion. Is it clear, Francisco? What? But Father... I mean it. <laughs> and don't forget to bring Father Alejandro's medicines after supper tonight. Understood? Yes. Yes what, Francisco? Yes. Good. Ah! What the bad way, brother? <laughs>
Australia are grown? Yes. <coughs> it's Francisco. Can I enter your room?
It's my privilege. Not a privilege, Roman. It's a responsibility. I don't need your ravish advice. Ross, come on, harm us, tune down. We have left with these responsibilities for the others and not for our own sake. Power is always for the others, to the others, and with the others. It is not intended for us, neither is given to us. Symbol of greatness. Well, well, brothers. <laughs> you might be jealous of me. No. <laughs> because I was appointed as choice right now. <laughs> the point, my dear brother, is you should not be driven by your pride. Pride is the cause of all evil doings. <laughs> well, well. It's nonsense, anyways. I have to go. <laughs> Remember, brother, this is temporal. <clears throat> we should be on guard. We don't know the time. And we don't have no good coming. We should stop Cromwell before it's too late.
then Father, what is its connection with God, our Father? <laughs> That's the question I want to hear from you, son. <laughs> you see, God is powerful and has sovereignty over all His creatures. However, humanity is created in the image and likeness of God. Is equipped with will and free to choose. But why will God punish sinners like Judas or Adam and Eve or Lucifer casting him out from the company of the seraphims? Nobody knows him except God, whom we cannot deny our motivation. What do you mean, Father? Son, if you will not accept your fault and continually deny God's unfailing help and merciful love to the invitation to repent and believe in the good news brought about by the gospel, you will be swallowed by your own pride. You should always remain in the ground despite all the achievements you have. Be on Christ and remember this. Faultless pride is the root of all other evil doings. Let us thank God for allowing us 
to experience his mercy and compassion. We love you both. We love you both. And by the way, tomorrow morning, I have to go to confession before receiving Holy Communion. That's good. It's the best thing you can do us right now, son. Well, I think it's already late. We have to take a rest. Let's go.